Hello guys and welcome to episode 2 of the Pokemon Heart Gold Nuzlocke and in today's episode we are choosing a starter and well I lost last footage because I'm an idiot and didn't um, private um, Mel and DS and OBS so I'm just gonna try to do this again so in last episode I asked you guys to choose my starter and guess what no one liked like I expected I expected that that's why I said I would choose Chikorita if no one um, liked so yeah, um, Chikorita is, um, I'm hoping this will go way faster, cause, you know, I have it. And I hope you guys cannot hear my fan, um, I'm gonna try to play with Audacity, if I have my door open and the fan. Um, we got Chikorita, you wanna give a nickname to Chikorita? It's a Mel. I named this guy Brian, cause I don't have internet right now. And I can't randomize my name, so when I get internet, I'll randomize a list of names, and that's how I'm gonna go. Um, I named this Brian because it's the first thing that popped in my mind, and I thought it was a female, and I was gonna call it Sophia, but that, that that's that's a video in another timeline. So, it's Brian the nickname you want to give it. Yes, it is. And we're gonna walk slowly. How do you like your walking with your Pokemon? It's not bad, is it? You can take all the way to Pokemon's, Mr. Pokemon's house, if your Pokemon gets hurt. You should heal it with this machine. It's so easy. Just check all my PC. Check the PC on my desk. Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and find rarities. His house is past Cherry Grove City. Go a little past Cherry Grove. I'm calling you, Edge. And then his assistant's gonna be like, Edge, I want you to have these to help you on your task. I obtained the potions. Take him on a week at the beginning. Do not hesitate. If to use a potion if yours is in danger. I wasn't reading that. I was literally looked away. Are we lagging? I don't know. I think it's just slow walking. Oh, la lava. Also, where are all my headphones? My? Okay. Well, we, ha we have no music. Oh, you guys have music. I don't have headphones. Oops. Edge! So you picked a Chikorita! That's a cute Pokemon you have. When you walk with it, it will become more friendly. You should turn around and talk to it sometimes too. Oh, that's right. Why don't you shout to your mom? See ya! And I'll in the hallway that you have to actually talk to your mom because you gotta get the Poké Heal. So, we're just gonna slowly walk over because it's Generation 4. I forgot how slow you walk in Generation 4. I actually forgot. Edge! That's a cute Pokémon! Oh, Professor Holmes gave you- Professor Holmes has a task for kind of task! I see, that sounds a little difficult. Wait, we were literally going- I completely forgot your Poké Heal came out from the, the Beef Shop. I received the Poké Heal. I'm sorry I'm running through this, but last episode was also 40 minutes, so I actually have the audio, so I could just record screen. No, that's actually a whole idea. The Pokemon Girl, or oh, Poké Girl as it's called, card, is what every trainer should have. Guess what? You can use the Poké Girl to make a phone call too. Do you remember how? I do, but you're going to explain it anyways. Just power on the Poké Girl and touch the cell phone screen. Still? Telephone icon, yep. The names of people you flagged Lord saw in the thing which you call. Oh, I can't believe so it's easy to make a cell phone call. Cell phone call. I love that card is cell phone. Oh my goodness. Uh, so, um, it's actually really awkward not listening to the music, but I actually kind of like it, so. I'm going to try to make this episode around 15 to 20 minutes long. Hey, <laughs> wait a second. Two hours later because it's slow walking. I almost forgot about this. Here, I'll give you my number. I restored Professor Elm and the Boogie Girl. Thank you. Then I'll call you if anything comes up. Thank you for wasting time. They literally had to animate him walking into his door. And we're on Route 29. Our first encounter- No, that, I made that joke a bunch of times in the last recording. That's actually really bad. I'm so happy I didn't lose like anything good. It's literally just me walking to- It's pretty much me doing the tutorial. <laughs> so, uh... Did you guys hear about uh, the Pokédex? Um, like, they're removing half the Pokémon. I'm not gonna say half the Pokémon. They're gonna uh, remove a decent chunk of Pokémon. Like, at least 300, I see. Um, because, well, Game Freak's removing half the Pokémon from Sean Shield, if you don't know. Um, because of animations that are really, really, really too much for them to animate, even though they look exactly the same as um, 3DS. The only thing that's different is the intro animations for some Pokemon. Which I don't think would take 
a long time. So, oh, Game Freak, why? Um, it's been theorized that they actually like couldn't do that because they um, modeled and probably animated each and every single Dynamax mod individually. They did not scale up the model. Well, they did scale up the model. They just made it its own model, though. Like, I, I probably could learn how to do better code than that. I just want to be honest. Um, watch stay on the grass because slow walking. Um, but yeah. Why Game Freak? Like, I hope they say that they're gonna add it in later in a patch. Like, I understand that they can't delay the game because of everything that's surrounding Pokemon. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay, everyone's a rookie trainer at some point. If you like, I can teach you a few things. Okay then, I'm not gonna give you the option. And what I'm gonna use the running shoes because this game is so f slow. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot you won't ruin the running shoes. I'll try to go as slow as possible. Thank you. This is the Pokemon Center, and they heal your Pokemon in no time. You'll be relying on them a lot, so you better learn how to use them, I think he said. This is the Pokemon Mart. They sell Pokeballs for catching wild Pokemon that you can buy, I think he said. Route 30 is this way. Trainers will be battling the Pokemon out there. If you go a little bit farther, you can go to visit Mr. Pokemon's house. Um, I think that's just, I'm, I'm really, like this, guy, like, this is so slow. This is the sea, as you can see. Can we have, like, the bad drum roll effect? Or, like, the bad, like, not drum roll, but, like, go bang. Something like that. I don't know. I'll put it in. I actually will put it in. Ah. Uh, there's only some Pokemon you can find in the water. That is true. There's no speed up, by the way. It's only, like, 50% speed up. Here, this is my house. For, your effort, I'll give, for keeping up with me, I'll give you the running shoes. They're still warm. Oh, okay. Wow. Last thing, I, get, I, I went, like... I said this guy's creepy and everything, but he said he, these are brand new, and he just gave us... Okay. Touch the sprint button to sprint, or we can press the B. See, what game was it where, like... I feel like it was this game, but, um... You can press B to walk, so can we get the town icon? I know you can go further, but I just want to see how you can get it. When I was a real lad, I was a hot shot trainer. Catch a lot of Pokemon. You can only take sets. If you catch more, they'll be sent to your PC. Luckily, we don't need to remember this. Treat a lot of them with kindness. Do not be game freaking. Um, think some Pokemon are better than others, and that they do not deserve to be in a Pokédex. Like I'm still gonna buy Sword Shield, but nah. <gasps> I made it. I, f I forgot about one thing. This is another token for me. Take it. The guy gent. Oh, it's a guy. I Why does this thing set? The guy gentleman, I think. Edge book I can do though. Okay, we do we really need to see this? And do I really not have my options speed? I think I speed up my options. Also, I'm trying to record this before um my family gets home because it's actually like I was like rushing and everything and I was like dying and I couldn't think correctly because it was so hot in the closet and ugh. And I think they'll heal, but you know. We're also gonna be making a long path and getting the item. Oh no, we can run! Oh my goodness, escape! So amazing. Though the imagine if they remove running shoes in the game. And you have to do it like by sensitive actually that wouldn't be bad. That wouldn't be bad. And we have to visit this guy's house because he's gonna give us a uh... People usually come to my house looking for Mr. Pokemon's house. You mean to visit uh, you didn't mean to visit my house though, right? Uh, how kind of you. Do you have any apricorns? Apricorns trees build fruit once a day. And I have one of those trees too. Apricorns are really something you can make Pokeballs and other things. They are quite useful. I have a feeling that this is meant to be. I'm so happy I'll give you this. I obtained the apricorn box. Thank you, Mr. Man. With the apricorn box, you can kill so many apricorns that you will be a decent apricorn collector. Thank you. This guy stopped me because I forgot to visit the house and I just felt bad. Like, I actually felt bad. Like, I'm like, wow. Now, let me continue on why I'm buying Pokemon Soul and Shield, probably. Actually, I'm probably gonna do it. I didn't buy Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon because it didn't come out on Switch, and I didn't. I don't like the 2DS. I hate my 2DS. I hate how the 2DS feels, and I think that's where some of my hate from Sun and Moon comes from. Also, I can run in the grass, but I shouldn't. Because of how uncomfortable the 2DS is, and I, I played Smash in the game. You can get Meta Balls on this route? Wow. I played Hot Gold so Silver, like, a ton, and I never, like... I knew like you can get metapods. I knew you can get calipes. I know we ran into a calipee um in the grass, but metapods. Hmm. Um. Oh no. 
Oh no, I forgot Betterf Betterfree's name. Oh no. Um, Betterfree's in Sword Shield, by the way, so. The Return of Betterfree. What was it, Brian? I think it was actually Brian. Wait. Wait, did I name, like, both and Brian? Oh my. Well, I think Brian or Bryant? I think Bryant was off Venomoth. Huh. I actually have to figure out. Because I actually like that name. That, that, that the guy's gonna be a legend. I remember Victoria's or Jorteon, so. We went to a Pidgey. But um, the reason I'm buying Sword and Shield probably, I, I, at least I'm gonna buy it. Like, I'm, it depends, like how much content's in the game. If they show off that there's actually a decent amount of content and that's why they had to cut the game, or some Pokemon from the game, I probably will buy it still. Um, if they come out and announce that they're gonna be adding um, Pokemon later, um, I would definitely gonna buy the game. Because I actually want to support developers like that. Like, them actually listening to the fans. Because I have a feeling Game Freak, uh, won't listen to the fans that often if we, like, like, look at Let's Go. <laughs> you must be Edge. I was the one who sent an emo to Professor Elm Oil. I must speak a lot better, by the way. <laughs> look, I messed up every sentence last time I recorded. This is why I wanted Professor Elm to examine. I obtained the mystery egg. That's epic. I'm the epic game. A friend of mine from Ecotique. Ecotique? Ecotique? Yeah, Ecotique gave it to me. I bet you can't find this kind of egg anywhere in Jotel. I thought Professor L might be able to tell what this is. He's the best when it comes to research. He's the best when it comes to the research of Pokemon Evolution. I did not read that actually in the first time, so I can't remember that. That's a quote from the famous Professor Oak. Oh, you're returning to Professor Elm? Hell, your Pokemon should have some rest. Thank you. I didn't hear the sound effect, but... She walks slow. And with that, I'm Professor Oak. A Pokemon re researcher. Uh, so you Edge. I was just visiting my friend Mr. Pokemon. I heard that he was running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A real Pokemon? I see. You must be helping with Professor Elm's research. I think I understand why Professor Elm gave you that Pokemon. You would treat your Pokemon with love and care, it seems. Ah, you seem to you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of the Pokemon. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. I'd like to give you one. I received the Pokedex. I don't think that icon down though. I mentioned that the last time I recorded this. Or the previous. The recording that didn't come up. Uh, what didn't. Because I'm an idiot. The recording that. Yeah. Um, that little icon down though. Uh, no options beside Pokeo. I don't think that's like. Ever gets filled. That really annoyed me. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I, I need to get to. I, I forgot the voice. Wow. I changed. We're changing numbers from Professor Oak. Oh, I also I learned from a friend that you can get Kyogre and Groudon in this game. I can believe I get um Kyogre and Sorcerer. So or Kyogre and Hot God. He's playing Sorcerer. <laughs> Hello, Hedge. It's a disaster. Uh, um, it's just terrible. What, what should I do? What, uh, oh no! Please get back here now. Click. Yep, that's all. That's all for this day's episode. Now, I, I think we've only been recording for like. 10 minutes actually. Um, I actually started the recording and I actually, actually, I have my mouse over, so I could have done it. But, um, or like stop the recording. Um, there's actually no pause functionality in OBS. That's actually kind of like, I missed that. I used to use the pause, um, functionality on Camtasia back when I had Camtasia, um, a lot. So that's actually kind of depressing that Camtasia, um, has a feature that OBS doesn't. So I'm guessing it's not a requ- uh, required um, a feature that many people want so uh, I actually just remembered it um, I don't know if this is it depends on how long it is it's until I get internet but I'm thinking about doing some showdown videos like maybe like a showdown video once a week or something and I was planning to have one go today which is Tuesday but I don't know if that's actually gonna happen so yeah it's because I've um, actually been playing Showdown a little bit with a friend. Actually, a lot with a friend yesterday. And I actually want to get into the League Battles again. I was used to be like a real, like... Like, I love League Battles. I love doing Showdown League Battles. It's so fun and everything. Like, it's actually... That's the enjoyment I find from Showdown. So... 
like the most. So I might get into a league. If not, I will definitely do laddering. Or just some random battles or something. I don't know. Because I just find that fun. And I want to get into playing with Pokemon before Sword and Shield comes out. Because I actually do think Sword and Shield is going to have an interesting metagame. And wow, I did not expect this. And that's why I was slow walking slowly. You got a Pokemon at the lab. Oh, that Pokemon's are too good for a wimp like you. Uh, jump, you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Wow. I'm actually being really good with my voices today. Like, I think I took two hours. No, not two hours. Um, figure out what this guy's name is. Well, this guy's name. Wow. I, I took one minute to figure out what to name this guy. You guys would not have never expected. Actually, I probably should have thought of a great name. <gasps> Cyndaquil, you slow. But um, I think Sword and Shield can have a great metagame. Not a great metagame. An interesting metagame. There we go. Also, this is going to take time, isn't it? Yep. So let me go on about why I think Sword and Shield will have an interesting metagame. And it potentially might be a really fun metagame. So I actually really like all the X and Y's metagame. And Sword and Shield is going to have the same thing. Except X and Y actually is going to actually feel complete. <laughs> You're doing okay for someone so weak. Well, it's someone weak, I don't know. Um, because the only game you only have like a certain amount of Pokemon, and then the Pokedex, oh, the Pokebank, like, and so much Pokemon, like, it just got really interesting, because it went from like, oh, these Pokemon good, and then to, oh, these Pokemon are now good, and new. And I hope they do that to so and show. Like, imagine, um, every couple of months, they add in like 50 Pokemon, 50 to 100 Pokemon to the Pokedex, just to allow you to be transfer them in from Pokemon Home. I think that would be like, that would definitely keep Pokemon Sword and Shield alive for another year. Well, alive during the months in the competitive scene at least. And they could wait like maybe another year for um, Sword and Shield the game sequel. Ooh, we got Razor Leaf. Yeah. Why does, why does Chikorita alone Razor Leaf? Only then Toyota gets Water Gun and Cyndaquil gets Smoke Screen. Like, why? We got 500? Oh, he definitely said something I missed. I'm sorry, guys. Do you know who I am? Or do you want to know who I am? I'm the, gonna be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. We should name him the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. That's what we're gonna name him. Give that back. That's my trainer card. Oh no, you saw my name. I love how I don't know about the dot dot dot. It's like it's a little like name. Or is it like name? Or is it like I don't know? Huh? Top 10 questions that I never asked before. I don't know. I'm not doing that. Making a top 10 video. I actually do want to make a top 10 video. And then I realized I actually can't make a top 10 video. Because I suck at thinking. Actually, yeah, I suck at thinking. Um, I suck at, like, organizing. I, I don't suck at organizing things. I just... We went the wrong way, don't we? We have to go through the... Oh, no, we don't. That 200 IQ... Just flowing through my blood. Like... Let's fade this. Um, I can't, like, I can think, because this is how I do all my news videos. I actually, like, all it out in a notepad. Just to, like, bulletin points, like... Uh, like, the UI stuff, and, like, my general ideas that I had. Because I don't want to pop up the images. That's what I did back in the PSS thing. And I didn't find that much, so... And that, um, fun and enjoyable to record. Who are you? We are the Visca and the case of a missing Pokemon here. Run number one! Best of all, whoever did it will come back to the site. Oh, oh, oh my, so you must be the one who did it. Oh, so long as I appear six times in the game, not five. Oh, hold on a second, you had nothing to do with it. I saw it. There was a red haired boy looking into the building. Yep. Actually, that's actually really suspicious, and why did he not point that out before? What? You better a boy like that. He must be the name that did it. Do you have any guy's name? And we got to name him. So you might be wondering, Edge, what did you name this rival? You must have some creative name, like Jack. Like, the, not the first name that goes to your mind. Well, I thought about it long and hard, and I called him Jack 2. No, we actually named him Boy, but I'm actually going to... I'm going to name him Dave. Yep, Dave. Dave is the perfect name. Jack, Dave, our next rival is going to be... Actually, if we play Gen 3, it's going to be a female, so we can't name... I was going to say, um... How was it? A uh, Bob? But... Hmm... Hmm... Why 
we gonna name? Oh, well, that's five hours off, and I'm, I'm gonna name it. Okay, May, May. I don't know any M Michelle, Michelle. Yeah. So Dave was his name. He, wait, he sees the name. Uh, that okay? That's the thing. It's a little bit too the door. Thanks for helping me on my investigating. Oh, then my next assignment is to search for the Red Hill individual. These guys suck at their job, by the way. I just want to point out. We battled him multiple times. If these guys cannot find, like, after there's only one guy, he's probably like on vacation or thing. Edge, oh, Edge, I'm glad they understand your identity. That's oh. <laughs> you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I'm dying. <laughs> I love it. I, love, I hate it, but I love it. I'm sorry. I'm dying. <laughs> Edge, this is terrible. Oh, oh yes, what was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? Oh uh, wow, I'm using Lyra's voice. Wow. I can't. Huh? This is a is it? This is maybe something I've never seen before. Still, it's just an egg. Mr. Pokemon is always fascinated by eggs. But since they gave it to us, we might be able to find out a secret or to act for a while to find out about the egg. What? Professor, I'll give you a poke that. Is it true that that's incredible? He's a boy I've seen potential of people as trainers for a while, Edge. I know you're a little different. Things are going to be fun. Your Pokemon seem to really like you, so why don't you take the Pokemon Gem Challenge? If you manage to defeat all the gem leaders, you'll eventually challenge the Pokemon Gem Leader Champion. Oh no, not to become the champion is not all at all easy, but you can certainly challenge Fire City's gem. Sounds like a plan. Edge challenging the gym scatter around the long journey. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. So this is where the actually Oh, can I talk to her mom? Are we forced to talk I think we are. I'm gonna go talk to my mom anyways, I'm not wasting a second. So I think this is not I'm gonna go cherry grow if we get our first encounter. Our first encounter last time does not count. And if we get it the same, I'll talk about it, and even if we don't, I'll talk about it. So you want to take all money and then spend it on super potions on a disc? Well, that's just amazing. Oh, you you always send money home, kids. Just just want to bring that. And you want to be running? Why? Well, you have a bank account for later in the game because I'm terrible about spending money. So at the end of the game, when I go back to kill, I'll be able to afford four restores, hyper potions. So yeah. And it's, and it's not like we can't come back, yo. I mean, we only have to go to Gym 5. Yeah, check us Gym 5 and just skip fly. I mean, that's not that far away. We can also run. Oh, it's Lyra. See, I forgot about that she teaches you to um, run. So I think there's only six things she does instead of five. What the hell are you? Oh. Edge! You can catch wild Pokemon with the Pokemon. Follow me! Following. Fo oh, Mario is in our face. Mario's tail is in our face. Wow. Ah, wow, 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 she got it, oh my, just like that, uh, was that too fast, try again, come this way, so let's talk about something, because this is actually going to be garbage, this is going to be like, sorry a second, uh, let me talk about, oh, uh, my schedule for this, I can't talk about this in the last episode, but, um, my schedule for this is going to be Monday, or oh, every other day, I was gonna say month, like I was actually gonna do what I did last time, but no. It's gonna be every other day, and I'm hoping to have this up um, on Wednesday. I was gonna have this up on Monday, but then I realized, wow, I don't want to record this on Monday. And then I waited till Tuesday, and I probably won't be able to upload this. So I'm just gonna wait for this video to go live. So I'm sorry actually for that, um, but I think this will be a good video. Also, if I had to speed up, this would be way faster. Gotcha. That I was caught. I thought the game froze. I was about to throw a fit. I was about to be like, oh, it went night time. Yeah, it's 5 p.m. right now. See, just like that. It's better to lower your target HP more than I did. Oh, you can make a sleep or something. You can eye all things. I'll give you these. Good luck. Thank you. And it also like officially starts. So instead of being like, oh, well, wait until the next episode to find out about our encounter, you have to wait until the next episode to find out about our. No. Just have that, um, that like, to be continued meme. But you just have that go. A first encounter is. <gasps> it's a central. Ah, uh, this is what I originally wanted. So, I'm um, gonna count the last encounter because, honestly, it's. 
I, I don't know. I probably should, but... Our last encounter was a Pidgey. And I named it Peach because, you know, I was thinking of female names with P. And, well, what popped in my mind was Princess Peach. Also, we should be able to tackle this thing. And, yeah, that's just popped in my mind. I was like, okay, I'm going to name it Peach. And we had Peach the Pidgey because, also, because, um... I thought of the character's name was Strawberry. Um, well, they named the Pidgey Strawberry, so I was like, oh, a nice little reference to that character. We're playing the game, just a nice little reference, please, no critical. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Why don't we get named Centric? Hmm. The male Centric. I want to name it Arceus. Can I name it Arceus? Would that, would that be like. I'm not going to name it Arceus. Like, also, I hope you guys can't hear my fans. I, I think I'll do one about this, but I hope you guys can't hear my fans. Um, I probably should record two episodes to actually write back and back, but... Eh. I actually know this is recording good. Before, I just was being an idiot. The Scout Pokemon, a very cautious Pokemon. It raises is something. But, um... Yeah, but I'm, I want to name it Walk, but, you know... It might not evolve. So, we're just gonna name it, um... Arceus. Because Arceus... Arceus, uh... Arceus? Is it Arceus or Arceus? It, well, like, which one is it? Like, wow. I actually don't know. I'm gonna assume what 20 minutes now. And I'm gonna assume that I can run to the next town and be okay. Um, because I actually really, like, I actually really want to record, like, just a bunch of episodes and have them, like, on the side and then edit them and everything. Which would actually be a great idea. But, um, I don't think that would be a great idea for, hmm, that was a critical hit. Please do not kill Brian. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. And yeah, this recording. Thank you. I didn't know how much I did. I was about to be like, I made a mistake. But I didn't make a mistake because I never make a mistake. So I am a legend. Oh, we can get another encounter. Ooh, should we get another encounter on this? We should. We should get another encounter. Also, I don't know why. I'm like, I'm actually gonna put the rival and like, put like him blacked out, and put him like question mark, like you know, like just something stupid like that. I did that with the final episode of like the blue Nuzlocke, because champion blues like ooh. You're not supposed to know Blue is the champion. I made jokes about that in the entire left play. But, um... It would be stupid for this, but, you know. We know his name now. His name is... Dave. And Dave is, uh... Complete joke. He's actually worse than Blue. Like, like ever since, um... Silver, I think his name is. Um, th like, the five of us just went like... Uh, we're just gonna be... Nicer. Cause... May is nice. May, I, May or Brandon, I believe. Um, Billy is nice. You have Generation 5's rivals, which is nice to you. Uh, you have it's alive multiple rivals, but there's really only one, which is um, who is it? Is it Serena? Is it that whole? I know that's the anime thing, but is it? I think it is Serena. I'm nice, but you have Shauna, um, Tino, and no, Teen. And travel. Yep. Get the, the guy with the vanilla, vanilla light shot. Um, and then you got Hal. Hi. Hal. Yeah. 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 Yep. Yeah. Name. Get guy with the name. Yeah, another belly. No. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's all the, like the rivals, so. This is really. And Hop looks nice. Hop just looks like another nice, like, friend. We don't know anything, but he just looks nice. He, he looks like the nicest guy ever. So. And. Let's go, rival. Which is your friendly rival. I get really nice with that as a thing. <laughs> it's like Gafi knows people want like a like one at least like have multiple rivals and have more than be like a complete complete a hole. Like just do it, but they won't. And I think that's what they did. Also, here's my prediction: if they do not um uh, like just a random prediction, if that they do not patch in the Pokemon uh, for Sword and Shield, Sword and Shield will sell less than Let's Go did. I'm putting out here, that's my prediction. Um, I'm also saying that because I did predict uh, Let's Go will sell like only 10 million copies. But of course I didn't have a YouTube channel back. Well, I did have a YouTube channel, but I didn't have a YouTube channel I was uploading to. 
so are we gonna get another cat? Nah. So, yeah. I, I, I would have made an entire video about how, why I was right and everything. Uh, I think people that are, uh, I think uh, the Switch is kind of expensive for people that just bought like a 2DS and 3DS for like Pokemon. Like I know I, I actually bought um a 2DS, a used 2DS for um, Pokemon Moon because my 3DS XL got stolen at McDonald's. So yeah, Pokemon is a driving force and it can sell a lot of copies but I, I think the Switch is still kind of expensive. I think if it gets down to $200 this holiday, I think Sword and Shield has a chance of actually being on par at least with the best selling 3DS game, which I was, believe was 16 million, or potentially even rivaling um, Gen 2, which was 20 million. I don't think a game is ever going to sell as close, or a Pokemon game skin ever sell as close as Ben and Blue did, but yeah, you can. I, I would like to say I hope, but. If Sword and Shield does sell that many, I'm afraid what it means. Uh, if they don't patch in all the Pokemon, but I'm rambling again, and that's why I like doing these last plays because I don't want to make videos about just me rambling. So if you guys do enjoy, well, you can like the video. You can subscribe because you watched the end of the video, and so you obviously like want to watch more this series. So you like my content for some reason. I don't know what's wrong with you, but you probably should get that checked out. Uh, you can. Yeah, I said subscribe. Um, you can comment below about if you're gonna buy Sword and Shield and why I shouldn't buy Sword and Shield and I should boycott it because Game Freak is not giving us the content we want. But yeah, Game. I was about to say Game Freak. Oh, wow, I'm tired actually. I gotta woke up at eight and it's five right now, so it's not even been that long. But thank you and goodbye.